with the smartphone application world you know, nowadays, it actually puts the ability to make adjustments to the shock in milliseconds without having to ever get out of the vehicle or reach around or grab something hot. And it's very, very fast acting. If they want to just quickly uh, select a preset that's geared towards the terrain that they're running and, and make that change and be on their way, they can do that. However, if they have a little bit more knowledge or they want to fine tune a little bit more, um, they can do you know anything from a global adjustment, all four shocks at the same time, or they can dial it down to the axles, or even so close as to dial it into each corner as well as compression or rebound uh, independently. As you see here, we can adjust compression and rebound independently, or we can link the two together and adjust them at the same time using either the slider or the little buttons there on the side. Um, in this setting, you can see that we're adjusting just the front axle. We can also adjust the rear axle. And uh, if you'd like to fine tune it even more, click the more button and we can come here to uh, individual corner settings and make these adjustments as we see fit. As you get more in depth with the system, as you get more experience, you can uh, you know, fine tune it to high speed whoops, low speed whoops, um, and add those in as your saved presets. So um, if you're used to running a specific area of the desert and you know this uh, group of settings works there, you can have it ready to go on the fly, hit the button, fly through that section, and then once you're out of that section, switch back to your general desert settings or even perhaps another uh, specific group of settings you have for the, the next section that you're traveling across.